In today's video, we're opening 24 classic Yu-Gi-Oh! GX packs and a couple that are not really GX, but they're close. What is up, everybody? We have a 24 pack old school opening today where we can potentially pull ultimate rares, ghost rares, you know, a lot of crazy old school stuff. But before we hop into it, we do have a giveaway. I'll be giving away. Actually, Clint is giving these away. He sent me five different giveaways. So we're going through the giveaways an original first at SDP relinquished and a Guilford Lightning, which got a very good three. So I'm guessing this is like, I don't know, out of somebody's like homeschool childhood collection or something. I don't know why I said homeschool. That's not right. But maybe at home you were playing with that card and that's why it's a three. But very cool giveaway giveaway all you have to do is like the video be subscribed turn on notifications let me know down below what's your favorite pack that we have here we have stuff like Gladiator destruction we have gladiators assault we have uh stardust overdrive whatever it's called i was gonna say starlight for some reason so let me know down below which one you like the most i'm hoping we could pull something crazy in this video and we're opening all this to get you guys ready for tonight's stream where we are opening let's just show this off two epic products one we are opening a little bit of today a first edition Light of Destruction booster box from 2008. So these are very, very rare. You can get the Ghost Rare Honest. Wait, did I say Ghost Rare Honest? Oh yeah, we're giving away a first edition Ghost Rare Honest near mint condition. So uh, yeah, if you're at the stream, you can win that. And we also have Retro Pack 2 that we're opening up. So two insane products that are like too big to show on the screen, but very, very cool stuff will be open tonight on the Whatnot stream. So go click the link down below, $15 free credit if you are a new user. If you are not a new user or you are, it doesn't really matter. Just make sure you go bookmark the stream so you guys know. 5 p.m. is when it's starting tonight, and uh, this will not be the only giveaway, but this is obviously the big one. I mean, this is about a $450 card, something like that. I bought on TCG. It actually came near mint. So shout out to TCG player and the seller on there. That was pretty awesome. So I'm excited to do that stream tonight. So I want you guys to be there. Go check it out. Let's get into the opening. All right, let's start off with Ancient Prophecy. In honor of giving away a Ghost Rare tonight, we're gonna pull a Ghost Rare right now and tonight at the same time. It's gonna be crazy. Lots of Ghost Rares. One, two, three from the back. Flippity Flop, I think, happens on this one, so we're gonna do that. Shiny Black Sea, we have the Sunny Pixie. Uh, Core Blaster, get that workout. Blaster uh, as well, right after that. We have RMC Hunter, Death Amulet. The Sauropod Brachion, and we are starting it off with a nothing burger let's go to a raging battle next raging battle has a lot of great cards used to be a much better set when you know a lot of the cards had not been reprinted etc i mean there were some crazy rares and commons in here there still are some but not quite as many the power tool dragon is still a really awesome ghost rare though so i'd be happy to pull that alien dog we have the psychic path proof of powerlessness the junk box rose tentacles fake feather supremacy berry We've got Against the Wind. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, what a secret rare. A mortal ruler right off the bat. Pulling a secret. These are not easy to pull. Secret rares back in. Look, I said GX earlier. These are kind of like the 5Ds era, but they're right after GX. So just like a year after. A mortal ruler. Very nice, shiny secret rare card right there. So starting it off pretty decent with a secret rare foil. Let's go to Stardust Overdrive. We're going to get to more GX era stuff coming up very soon. Some big ones like Glass and One Destruction. I mean, some very, very fun openings, some fun stuff. I did a little variety instead of going with like all one set because I just really enjoy doing a variety of these uh, old school like Ghost Rare, Ultimate Rare sets. It's just fun because you never know what you'll get. Ashleon, we have Gemini Booster, Energy Bravery. And speaking of uh, a variety, we have Light Destruction and Retro Pack 2 tonight, which is going to be really cool. And Retro Pack 2 already has enough variety in and of itself. Going for that Shining Dragon. We have Earthbound Revival and a Seal of Wickedness. Another foil. That's two super rares. Start or one super, one secret. Two foils, I should say, already. Very, very nice. And I'm hoping that can continue when we open Gladiator's Assault. And no, we do not want what's, what's the ones we always pull. What is that guy called? Um, if I forget, I want to pull it. I got to remember. I got to remember uh, the energy monolith. We don't want the soul absorbing monolith or energy monolith, whatever that thing's called. Super energy, whatever. I don't remember what it is. We do not want that. So please don't pull it. And especially not an ulti. That would be a, a shame of an ulti. Three, three from the back. I think it just might be three from the back on these. I'm not sure. Lucky cloud. Interdimensional warp. Cloudy and smoke ball. Gambler of legend. I cannot pull these cards. Light imprisoning mirror. Truck road. Summon cloud. Goblin Black Ops. Oh, we got a fusion card. There are fusion commons in here, like Gladiator Beast. I think, no, that's a rare, isn't it? Is there a fusion? Com I'm assuming there is. 
Yeah, Super Alloy Beast Raptinus, the Gemini card. So yeah, fusions usually, I mean, there's a lot of big things in glass. A lot of them are fusions, so I got a little excited. Light of Destruction, let's try you. You could have the Ghost Rider Honest, which we are giving away tonight. First Ed, though, this is the Unlimited. I would still love to pull it, because I've never pulled Honest in First Ed. I think I pulled the Unlimited Secret Rare. That's the best I've done. Three from the back. We have Short Circuit. Volcanic Queen, that is a... I think I lost an auction series against that. We have Summon Limit, Interplanetary, Invader A, uh, Portable Battery Pack. Or maybe I used it and I didn't win. Realm of Light, I mean, I didn't win most of the time. Goblin Recon Squad. We have Substitute. We are pulling so many of these now that they are being reprinted and not worth 30 bucks anymore. And Battery Man Charger. So with on the Light of Destruction. Don't worry. We still have Tactical Evolution. These are such weird seals. Like, they're like really short for some reason tactical ev we have pulled the rainbow dragon two different times and that is not going to make me not want to pull it again so let's just do it again one two three from the back tactical evolution phantom cricket rux and special next gift of greed chrysalis mole goggle golem cocoon veil chrysalis pantail double summon and the counter counter all right very nice also if you guys have not checked out ruxum34.com recently go check that out we have added a bunch of new uh, psa graded cards i added some rarity collection cards like full sets of supers ultras and secrets go check that out if you guys haven't you want to grab uh you know just all the cards from the set you can do that there for a decent price uh four from the back here and uh, of course, uh, what not tonight? Of course, if you have not, if you've forgotten in the last three minutes, we have a big show tonight. It's going to be really exciting. Biggest one we've done since probably the LOB. It's pretty big. I mean, two, I haven't opened Retro Pack in a long time, so I'm excited. And a malfunction, so that did not go so well. All right, Rise of Destiny. Let's keep it going. First edition, Rise of Destiny. Oh, not first ed. I'm just used to this being first ed. It's actually unlimited, which is pretty unusual for Rise of Destiny. So kind of funny. One, two, three, four, I think it's fine. Four, I'm gonna do four. We have uh, Moki Moki Smackdown, Harpy Lady three. Can we get something big? Cause so far we've got a secret rare, so that's pretty big. I mean, outside of that, it's just been one super muddy go. Hey. Tragedy, always, uh, always pulling the tragedy. It's just really rubbing it in when you're not having good pulls. It's like tragedy right now. Oh, it's such a shame. Okay, we still got a lot of a lot of packs left, so I'm not gonna freak out yet. We have Ancient Prophecy. Can we pull something big here? Ghost Rare, maybe. Ghost Rare, Ultimate Rare. I mean, there's a lot of great options from ANPR. Can we get any of them? We have Quackimir Hydra Barrier, Sunlight Unicorn, Damage, Translation, Hydra Pressure, Counter, Arm Sea Hunter. We have Sunny Pixie, Jester Lord, and we have. Skill six. Oh, that is a hollow, actually. I always forget that this is a super rare. You can't even see it when you know it's a super rare. Like, okay, there it is. That is one of the most subtle super rares in Yu-Gi-Oh. There is no way I would know that if I just did. Like, I just know off the top of my head it's a super rare. If I didn't know that, I would have definitely skipped over that thing. So that counts. That was, I remember when that got released in Duel Links. And it was kind of a weird, it was a super rare in there as well. I was like, okay, this is kind of a, it's okay, I guess. It's not really that great in terms of playability. Okay. Ghost Rare Time, Gadget Arms, no big ultis yet. We have a secret. So an ulti or ghost would obviously make this pretty amazing, especially a ghost. We have Moha and, okay, Synchro. Synchro, this could be big. Power Tool Dragons and Synchro, it comes in Ultra, Ulti, and Ghost, obviously. And then there's a few other, what are, I can't even think of some other Synchros right now. What is the, oh, is that, no, is that the stats? 2300? No, that's Blackwing, Armwing. Yeah, I think it's 20, what is it? 20, what is, what is Power Tool? 25 or 24, I don't remember. But Armwing is a very cool card, I mean, Edison card, so I'll take that. I always like Edison cards. Uh, so foil's a foil. It's a nice card. Not bad at all. I mean, I, we got excited because we saw Synchro, but unfortunately it was not uh, It was not something huge. That would have been really cool. So let's try Raging Battle for something huge. We have Insect Neglect. We have now four foils, which isn't bad. Stygian Dirge, Magician, Swap Rock, especially random packs, so it's not bad. We have Bargain, Energy Bravery, Inter Inherited Fortune, and... Uh, Okay, Sea Panther. I thought I was saying interrogation for some reason. Let's skip glass and light destruction. Come back to those on this round. Let's do uh, let's do Shadow of Infinity just for the potential uh, sacred beast right here. I'm guessing this isn't a hobby pack. I don't actually know. But even if it isn't, we can still get the ultra sacred beast, which is something I've literally never pulled, which is ridiculous at this point with how many packs we've opened. I mean, I've opened like almost half a case, I think, of Shadow of Infinity in terms of first head boxes, plus all the loose packs. So it's pretty wild. Factory, Ancient Gear, we have full stop. We even opened two boxes at once, one time. Still didn't get anything. End of the world. Proto Cyber Dragon. Oh, yeah, so there's no, because uh, it's 2006 in uh, Shadow of Infinity. 
Is it six or five? I think it's 2006. So there's only rares or hollows. So you don't get both. Rise of Destiny. This is 2004. This is our oldest pack here. Not probably one of our least exciting because there's a couple of nice cards, but most of it's, you know, it's in that weird era where they swapped from, from the original. They're kind of going to GX transitioning to that. And then they also added ultis, which was good, but there was a really small set. So not a lot of cards in there. Element source. So it's kind of strange. Hunting Ground, Flame Sprite. We have Zingzen Hu. Mirage Dragon, and they didn't really give anything super iconic in here. Creator is cool. Uh, Proto, and then uh, Perfect Machine King is also really cool. But, you know, there's still some something left to be desired with that set. Gladiators Assault. Let's go back around to the, this in Light of Destruction. Try to pull something crazy. Come on. Let's do this. If you guys like these old openings, tonight is your night. Live stream will be on whatnot. Go check it out. $15 free credit. If you guys haven't already. It's going to be super, super fun. And it's going to be a good time. So make sure you're there. Glad he's returning. We have Gambler of Legend, Light and Pristine Mirror, Truckroid, Summon Cloud, Dark Fusion. That used to be like a $4 rare. And Release from Stone. So it's released from the stone. Oh, we didn't do Tactile Evolution either. Let me do that first. Tactile Evolution, Rainbow Dragon, Dark Bright Boom, Ultimate Rare Elemental Hero. One, two, three, four. Are these all upside? No, just this is upside down. That's strange. Okay, let's go like that. Okay, I think that'll work. Crystal's Larva, we have Flintlock. Rise of the Snake Deity, Dawnbreak Gardener. Gravitic Orb, maybe it meant something because it was upside down. Ambush, we have Wrench. We have Cocoon Party and an Elemental Hero, Neos Alias. So yeah, it did mean something. This is one of those, this is one of those slimy packs out of the uh, Special Edition, I think. So that's pretty interesting. Neos Alias, technically an Edison card as well. We'll take it. All right, last card of this round, Light of Destruction. Here we go. We'll be opening up 24 packs of First Ed tonight, which is pretty exciting. 24 packs of First Ed. One, two, three. Wetlands, D Fortune, Batterman Charger, Inter Interplanetary Invader A. There we go. Quick Charger. Gladian Storm Dragon, Hero Mask. The Arcana Force, 14 Temperance. And that's a hand trap. And the Volcanic Queen back at it again. So we are on to the final round. Let's do Rise of, Rise of Destiny first, I think. On to the final round. So far, it's been an okay opening. We've had a secret and a bunch of supers. So if we can get an Ultra, maybe an Ulti goes, something like that, that'd be pretty great. So four from the back should work. You're kind of going straight there. Maybe that means something. Rage of Flame Sprite. Zing Zen Hu. Whoa, a double. Rux is special right into another Zing Zen Hu. So we got double Zing Zen Hu, which is funny because it blocks off two cards in spell trap zone. Uh, Rock of the Valley of Haze. We have Light in the Loot. Nightmare Penguin and oh, a Silent Swordsman level three. That's a good card. Ultras in this era are very tough to pull, about one in 24. So that is a very nice pull. Silent Swordsman level three, really cool card. We'll take it. Not an ulti, but still really, really nice. Next, let's do Ancient Prophecy. So we do have an ult, we have an ultra. We have a secret. We have some supers. We just need an ulti or a ghost now. And really, I mean, both would be great, but that's probably not going to happen. So we're just going to hope for one of them. If we get one, then we can start asking for the next one. Blackwing Mistral. At ghost, I think we're just happy, but beast, psychic soul, shark cruiser. At one with the sword, quacky mirror boulder. Falcon and ancient crimson ape. Another fail on that one raging battle raging battle we only have six packs left out of our 24 we've opened today if you guys have enjoyed it don't forget to subscribe to the channel because we will be opening more old school packs gx original all that different stuff you know as we go as we go throughout the years and stuff gets older stuff gets you know released all that stuff we'll be opening everything we have hedge guard mind trust literally everything i've opened everything mirabos we have emperor sim and Ooh, quacky mirror war arms another super rare so this is kind of one that you will not remember, Quacky Mirror War Arms, unless you played with it at some point. But I don't know if, Qua I guess at some point, Quacky Mirror might have been good. They were good in Duel Links, I think. But I think Duel Links tends to take things that are have never been good in the TCG and make them good. So probably meant nothing to uh, most people. Three from the back. Flippity flop, floppity flip. We have Synchro Barrier. Quick Draw Synchron Edison card. We'll take it. We have Herculean Power. Gemini Spark. If I can pull it, Gemini Counter. Spiritual Forest. War of the Earthbound. We have Stardust and... Uh, Infernity Necromancer. Okay. Leaving us with four back big packs left. Let's do uh tactical evolution before these other ones. Rainbow Dragon is big. We have pulled it before though. That's where we're gonna go with this one first. Because the rest of these sets, I've there's a lot of things I've not pulled in them. Tactical evolution, I've pulled mostly everything that you could want out of here. And we pulled the ghost rare first ad and on un and in unlim. I cannot open this thing. Okay, one, two, three. It's upside down again, which is really interesting. Let's flip that around. Last time it was a foil, so maybe it means that again. Dawnbreak Gardena, prefer contact. Can we go back to back? Dark Effigy, Alien Shock Trooper. These are extremely uh, 
what is what is the word slimy gravitic orb and the snake rain so that that one was also upside down didn't mean anything snake rain was also one that was big until it got that reprint in ancient guardians i think we'll do uh shadow of infinity first because of course we still need to pull the ultra rare or ultimate rare sacred beast any of them any beast can be pulled and we will be happy let's do this one two three four from the back we have a quacky mirror or ancient key your cannon. I don't know why I thought it was a Quaxi Mirror. I guess they're kind of similar. Hero Kid, Rux is special. Machine King prototype. Speaking of Machine King earlier, Saber Beetle. Magnus Circle level two. And the Phantasmal Martyrs Rare, leaving us with two packs left. Okay, we'll do a lot of destruction first because we are opening it tonight. So, glass we're not opening tonight. First Ed, 24 pack box opening tonight and a retro pack two on one knot. So don't forget to bookmark the stream. Be there at 5 p.m. Central. Here we go. One, two, three from the back should be fine. Arcana Force 3, Summon Limit, Great Card, Space Gift, Destiny Hero, Dread Servant, Spell Gear, Interplanetary Invader A, Arcana Force 18, The Moon, Light Barrier, and a Wetlands, another one that used to be pretty decent. All right, leaving us with one pack left. Guys, don't forget to subscribe to the channel if you want to see more old school openings. Here we go. Last pack magic. Gladiators of Sold First Edition. I just ripped up that pack. Whoops. Just ripped it up. Just destroyed it. These are these ones just don't tend to stay together very well. Glass. They're very, very fragile. Three from the back is an upside down card here. I don't know if it's four, but I'm going to do that. We have Perry. We have Hoplimus. Can we get a Ghost Shark Chaos Neos? Can we get necroface can we get magic formula they would be huge test tape come on oh it was a foil okay so it was four from the back on this one interesting cunning of the six samurai okay so we ended up with a decent amount of foil actually a really good number of them overall nothing like crazy this time but that it does bode well for the other loose packs i have hopefully we can pull something big in those so i'll see you guys tonight at 5 p.m central for the massive opening shout out to tone for show and nestor deanda america deutscher kk beats brandon cheney ian musa junior barning robert f changalang adelso Garcia jr and edwin k thank you guys for supporting the channel i'll see you guys in the next one